Hey guys, back to another video. And today, uh, obviously, it's on pedal, obviously. I'm pretty sure you can tell. But, I'm gonna teach you how to use the, R the one and only RT 97C. Yes, I know. This gun, no one uses it. Pretty much, no one uses it. Oh, crap. Because it is pretty much still DLT 19, the very first weapon. But, just a tiny bit worse. Because the only reason how it's worse is because of the spread. I'm pretty sure no one likes that. Here you go, TK. That is why people don't use it. Well, it's because that's not how you're supposed to use it. You're not supposed to hold down the spread. You're not supposed to hold down the button. Uh, DLT 19, you can you can just hold down the button and keep firing. But with this gun, you can't do that. You gotta tap it really quickly. You gotta keep tapping and tapping. Because, like, if you're shooting at a long range, a medium range, you should use it when a gunfight. Okay, but in long range, you should you should try tapping it really quickly. But in this, oh, nice! I got some of my daxes. Yeah. So I have my daxes. And then. So yes, this is art. It does a bit more weapon damage than the DLC 19, but the range is also up as well. But its spread is really the problem, so that's why I recommend focus fire. It's really, it's a really good choice to deal with spread, and it can go at very long. Oh come on! What the heck was that? I saw some like tail, all oh, ice pillar, right? That's why I recommend the focus fire. It helps shoot some. Whoa, whoa. Help shoots at extremely long ranges. With ease. It'll just make your life a whole lot easier. And plus, if you actually use this weapon, it's really. Oh, God! If you get used to this weapon, it's really, really powerful. Or, but you can also use cooling, though. I can also recommend that. If you learn to tap the gun, like a long. If you, if you keep pressing the gun, learn. Learn long enough just to keep tapping it to get someone at long range. Then I recommend, uh, hi Chris. And then I would probably recommend, and then I'd probably recommend cool himself. Let's see here. See? You're supposed to just tap it. I'm doing it so fast, you might not be able to see. But if they're really close, you can just hold it down. You can just hold down the button. Oh, 150 hitting bonus, so yeah. But then let's go on. Okay, so focus fire, let's do one. Let's sell this down though. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh gosh. And then, second one. Back to bottom. I highly recommend you use this. Always use it before you go into battle. It's very, very, very useful. And whenever you're in high damage, you just, you can just throw down the back bomb pool. And just, like, you can just sit in it as you're just mowing down these people. And if you ever use, and if you have cooling cells, it's even better when you're at back to bombs. So we can just keep mowing them down non-stop. And it's absolutely beautiful. It's just amazing. And then the last one, Dax grenade. This is just one of my personal choice. You can change it to whatever you like. I just recommend you. It, you don't have to use choose Dax grenade. This is just what I use. So that way I can get people out of round corners, that way I can kill them easier. And plus, sometimes I actually do get kills with them. And yes, yes, the action A just makes a big pool of obvious- of com- Ah! Scattergun! Of complete, obvious green gas. Yeah, I'm pretty sure- Oh, gosh. That's why you need, um, back to bomb when you go into the thing. That's very obvious. But it draws people out in the round corners. And it lets you know if people are there. That's why I- so the RT-97C, you should make sure to tap it at long range. Close range, you can just hold down the spray button. Uh, 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 darn you, Rodians! No, oh, skin pulls, that's why you got me. Actually, no, that wasn't, that was just a lie. But yeah, that's pretty much how you use the RT-97C, but how I see it. And plus, make sure you're always very careful with this weapon. Unique, it has a lot of spread. But make sure, make sure, I cannot stress this enough. Make sure you tap it really fast. Make sure you tap it when you're shooting at long range. Like you see here the little weights? Make sure you're tapping it like that. If you don't do that, then and you then you cannot get people. You cannot. Well, maybe you can if you're lucky. 
I like the first couple shots. It's yeah, yeah, it's easy. You can easily get. But then it starts to twist and turn. Mm, nice kill. Blur. Can't move, can't go down that way now. Okay, I was paying attention. <laughs> and yeah, that's pretty much how. That's pretty much what I recommend for the RT ninety seven C. And yes, this is not a competition between which gun's better. In my opinion, I like this gun better. But sooner or later, I will switch the cooling cell, maybe. Because this gun can overheat fast. If you have a close shot with this weapon, I don't recommend a closer shot with this weapon. It, um, overheats just way too fast. If you know what I mean. So, I hope you liked the video. Well, like, press the like button if you like it. Obviously. Oh my gosh, we're losing badly. I didn't even know we were losing that badly. And, uh, subscribe if you wish. And, um, if you watch my videos, I will see you on the next video. <laughs> Goodbye.